did they come out with a new DLC fairly recently? You got very addicted to Stardew Valley. Are you playing um, vanilla or are you playing with mods at all? And as always, keeping the grind with Age of Empires 2. I had no clue you were interested in Age of Empires 2. And the Final Fantasy 14. You're doing the Stormblood. Oh. Also, I hope your family's doing well, Kat. Um, of course, I love seeing pictures of Floyd Boy. I know you're hoarding more pictures. Each time you post a picture, I was like, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, this looks satisfying. This guy got wrecked over there. You haven't finished Scarlet's main game? I haven't got the DLC yet. Oh, how do you like Scarlet though? Do you like it better than Sword and Shield? Oh. Also, Cat, I think you would like this game, by the way. I think this game would be up your alley. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. She's got a flamethrower. Whoa, that's electricity. All right, let's get a heal. Or not. I guess close in on her. Yeah, try to hug. Okay, okay, okay. I'll just walk past you then. Go for you. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh, was I supposed to duck that? I'm supposed to duck that, chat. Okay, that's a pillar. It's a pillar of lightning. Oh, you could throw that back at her. Okay, we're dead. This is interesting. I am looking forward to this. I heard, I haven't heard of this game. I'm guessing it's Souls like. Yes, it is Souls like. It's like a uh, Souls like. It's like inspired from Bloodborne, and then Metrovania, uh, Castlevania had a baby. I'm enjoying uh, Pokemon Scarlet a lot. Uh, I'd definitely be on top of the list, uh, if not for performance issues. And I play Stardew on the Switch, so no mods, but I've been enjoying it a lot. In the middle. Okay, cool, cool, cool. This game is goaded. What's her? All right, we got a dash when she jumps up like that. Yeah, we can't get a heal. For some reason I didn't get a heal. Okay, we can't, we can't, we can't um, be next to him. I thought it just strictly attacks the ground, but that answers that question. We haven't used our uh, our uh, special attack on them yet. So, dash towards her. Looks like the fire's not doing too much damage. She sadly went over there. Get a heal in there. Dude, I think I have to full jump that. I think I have to full jump it. Oh, I got I could duck that. I could duck that. Okay. Ah. Uh, I try to Oh, I'm going to get hit. Duck it. <laughs> it just smacked me in my face. All right, yeah, we could duck that. Okay, okay. Yeah, it just came out like a week and a half ago. A week and a half ago, I believe. It's really fun. Really fun. 
has a lot of lore in it. No pun intended. Not as much damage as I thought. Oh, actually, it is more damage on the boss fight. Uh, so sneaky, huh? I'm so floaty, though. And I can't backstep it. Hi fi rush. Oh, you, you finished it. How did you? Uh, oh, I can't throw it. And you get a repost on it. Oh, let's freaking go! <laughs> That's so cool. That's so cool. Hey, you want to throw more of those? I wouldn't. I wouldn't complain. All right. Yeah, let's go. Give me that. Okay, okay, I was joking, I was joking, I was joking. Let's get a heal. One more heal. Get another heal in there. Get a duck. Duck. So much damage, too. I almost want to keep her alive so I could get a good hit. Okay, you hit the other platforms. Okay, okay, all right. Interesting. Well, gotta head to bed now so I can help up and finish packing. I appreciate you, dude. That was a good attempt. Thank you. I appreciate that. Having a neat job that finishes at a decent hour. Oh, that's a, that's definitely a godsend right there. All right, get smacked immediately. Oh, we got a crit. Ouch. Back away. All right. Sadly, I wasn't facing her. Oh no! Uh, I wanted to punish, but it's okay. Oh, nice! You could, if you do enough damage, you will be able to. Cool. I can't. Almost have to. Yeah, I have to like. faster okay I didn't get there in time I don't know if I could use the same method oh my gosh you're going so fast lady get a heal in all right oh she does dodge it She's cool. Literally cool. Dodges her own nuts. Uh, got four heals left. Duck. But, uh, how do you like your job right now, P1? Getting a little faster. Yeah, she goes so fast, you can't even punish it. No! Just one more hit. Well, that went pretty well. Went pretty well. K1 
cat brought the good luck charms with the raid. Thank you so much. Where the heck am I? You're welcome. Yeah, they have moments like this, cat. Definitely up your alley, I think. Look how broad his sh back is. Just screams like cat with fawn over it. <laughs> I don't forget what she said the first playthrough watching Barrett's back in Final Fantasy VII remake. I don't. I don't forget those things. Heart of Nycrix. No servant of the church can evade the thirst. Oh, coincidence. The desperate pursuit for more. Their promises were forged, secret sealed, pulling their souls into a ceaseless hunt. <gasps> Snuggy Bun, thank you for the raid. How are you doing? Sack of potatoes. How are you doing, Smitty? Hello, hello. Welcome on in. The buns are here. Oh my gosh. Absolutely appreciate it. Let me give. I didn't even give you a proper hello, cat. Give it a shout out, Snuggy. I had the pleasure of meeting Snuggy Bun at Vegas. I didn't have the the opportunity to chat with her as much. I think I was chatting off Morale's ear. Grant, that was also my first time meeting her. But um definitely love catching her Instagram stories whenever I can. I hope you're feeling a bit better. Uh it is a pleasure to see you. Thank you so much for the raid. I hope uh, Phasmophobia, do you, I saw you were playing Dead by Daylight the other day too. I saw, I also am a world-class lurker in case you're wondering, but yeah, Snuggy Bun, absolutely amazing person, um, handles organize, organizing for uh, Save the Children charity, uh, if you're ever interested in doing charity events, things like that, uh, she's a great person to chat with, also morale also. But um, yeah, you play tons of DBD. I am. Thank you so much. You've been taking care of yourself. I'm so happy to hear that. So uh, were you playing Phasmo solo? Were you playing with friends? What, what is that quote, Sonny? What is that quote? But yes, I appreciate it. Nice to meet you all. Smitty, I hope you're doing absolutely lovely today. You're playing with friendos? You're going to get going? Yeah, like, of course, Cat. Thank you so much for the raid. Definitely check out Cat. Princess Cat Power, you will absolutely love her. She raided us later. I had the pleasure of meeting her at PAX East. She streams a variety of games. You'll usually see her fawning over Kiryu and Yakuza 0 through 60,000. One of those. Eventually, she's going to get at playing uh, the man who raced the name or uh, was it Ishin. One of those two. I'm pretty sure those are definitely on her radar to play. But uh, definitely check her out. Also, super awesome person to get to know and chat with. And she gets super immersed in her gameplay, too. But yeah, Snuggy Bun, thank you so much. Chat made me go solo one time, though. Do you get? Do you normally play spooky games? Do you normally play the spooky games? But thank you so much, Snuggy Bun. Seriously, I appreciate it. Yeah, for those who are new here, yeah, I'm Fox AMT. It's a pleasure to meet you. I play a variety of games. Right now, I'm playing a game called The Last Faith. Also play games like Cuphead, Hades, Dark Souls, Dark Souls. Well, I need to play Dark Souls too, but Dark Souls 3, uh, Sekiro. Um, just games that happen to be a little more difficult. And then occasionally, I'll play a lot more indie-esque games and stuff like that. But yeah, more than welcome. We do have a Discord. We do have other socials. You're more than welcome to hop in. You're more than welcome to just chill and hang out. But yeah, I appreciate it. Snug, I, I know it's probably pretty late for you right now too. But I'm happy you're feeling much, 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 much very better. I'm happy to hear that. Promises were forged, secrets sealed, pulling their souls into a ceaseless hunt. Contestants, what's behind coffin number three? Propulsion bolt. Oh my god. Finally. Oh. 
so many places where I can't just dash into and stuff like that. Snuggie is the bravest scaredy cat. Oh my goodness. That's what we love to hear. That's what we love to hear. The bravest scaredy cat. Something or someone is watching over me, for these are most exquisite. I sense they have been used well by those who walk these hands. Yet this is the abandoned city. No splendor should remain, haunted by the memory of the one who deemed himself misunderstood. Talk is that he sought absolute knowledge and obtained it. Press B while in the air to dash forward. Oh, oh, oh. It's so nice. I could move forward in the air. I could fart in the air. Oh, God. Thank you. To let everybody know I had Taco Bell today. I actually didn't, but you know. Oh, man. Snug, how are the kids doing? How's everything holding up? Oh, wow. I'm on the other side. Wow. Okay, bro. Contestant, check out what's behind coffin number four. Thunder Conjuration. A close combat weapon built by independent researchers. The Conjuration is highly unstable. An example of Institute Scientia's less solid workmanship. Originally crafted for Ethereal Order in their research, it was spectacularly purloined by one of their aberrant and loyal test subjects. Now whoever chooses this weapon is a threat to both those they pursue and themselves, a technology that should not be used frivolously. Kids are doing great. They had a great break. It's back to school until winter break. Does winter break start on the 19th for you? Or will it be... Because Christmas Eve is on the weekend. So that means... I think... Uh, what is it? Oh, it starts on the 25th? Whoa! Okay, okay. The weekend. The weekend is normally off. The weekend is not counted. But because Christmas is on a Monday. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, that's really... Oh, man. I bet you're you're having a ball with that. Wait, how far can I go? Can I make that? Can I actually... God. Don't even know if I can make these jumps anymore. I've been scarred into not knowing I can utilize these. Oh, it's not a weapon. Oh, it's a spell. Mind and instinct. Interesting. Weapon requirements. Instinct needs to be 15. What is my instinct? 11. It's a pain, too, because we have... Um, Yule, wait, is it Yule or is it Yule? When I say Yule, I'm thinking Soldier Boy. I'm thinking Crank That Soldier Boy. So I have to pull the kids out early, anyways. Oh, interesting. Like Soldier Boy. Okay, okay. Yule. I knew, I knew that would that reference would come in use. People thought I was crazy. They're correct. They're absolutely correct. Uh, I don't think I can have access here. He was recommending like the green spot too, right? Oh God, it's four hours in. Oh boy. Maybe I should, maybe I should level up. Snuggy, what type of music do you listen to? I know it's not Soulja Boy. I know you're not playing all the variations of Crank That. But are you are you a metalhead by any chance? Do you do you dabble with The Rock? Well, not Dwayne The Rock Johnson, but you know. Jump to 583. Dexterity. Oh, it goes up by two now. Oh. Oh, 
has a plus two scaling now. That's pretty satisfying. Some country I oh you dabble oh you okay. So that's I I don't hate gospel, but I listen to enough gospel where I'm like, eh, it's not my favorite. It's not my favorite. But uh I mean I if somebody puts it on, I'm just not gonna eh, it's alright. It's alright. It's alright, I guess. But, uh, oh, you do, you can't do, like, super screamo or mumble rap. You don't like any type of mumble rap? You don't like, like, you don't, you don't dabble? Because some of the, sometimes the beat can hit, right? And you're just like, I'll deal with the beat. And then sometimes the, the mumble, they're like, and you're just like, I want to laugh, but the beat is fire, so I don't know. You, just, you people think you're like you're you're liking the song. You're like, no, I'm just liking the beat. Oh, Minerva! I just saw. Well, actually, I've been watching your stream for quite a bit, but I was um, I was seeing you chat in Witty's uh, stream earlier. Oh, are you a fan? Have you been playing, or have you beaten it? Oh, I should also give a shout out. Minerva, because I think they, she was doing uh, music, a music stream recently. Oh, you're playing Disco Elysium. Only played a little. I was really liking it, though. I love these kinds of games. Fox, are you going to play Maple Story? I thought Six Job was already out. I'm all over the place. Nice to meet you all over the place. I'm Fox AMT. It's a pleasure. And I knew Snuggy. Snuggy, Snuggy is good peoples. I appreciate you rating me, Snuggy. I hope you have an awesome lurk. Enjoy doing the post stream stuff. Enjoy. I, I'm pretty sure you already, the kids are probably already tucked away in bed. But I appreciate you so much. Thank you so much. Give you another shout out. Yeah, I thought I recognized your name. <laughs> I, I, yeah, I, I was the guy who randomly posted a Lee clip because I was watching like three other streams at once and I thought I was posting in their discord, but yeah, Coded on. Thank you for the, thank you for the resub, dude. I appreciate it. Oh no, Minerva. You saw that? No, no. I thought, I thought people were lurking. And he was so confused. Luckily he didn't look at it. I was just like, I, I was in chat and I, I opened up Discord and I hit copy and paste and then I I looked and I looked at the stream that I uh, clipped from getting ready to close the tab that I clipped from and then Woody was like oh what's that clip Fox I was like what are you talking about and then I look at the chat I was like no so I click it to attempt to delete my own message which I forgot you can't do and I ended up pinning it like an like an absolute fool. Multi, yes. I'm always watching like four streams and watching a YouTube video and in like multiple Discord chats. Yeah, I'm a, I'm an absolute clown when it comes to like, oh god. It's like you feel you feel the cringe. You feel the cringe now. You feel it. Well, Minerva. Officially welcome on in. I hope you like Fox emotes. Uh, I think some of them are Christmas themed. Uh, I need to ask chat. I need to ask chat um, what emotes they actually prefer. Because um, I'm going to keep uh, putting up emotes you don't like. Comfy cringe. Comfy. You love foxes? Oh, thank God. Thank God. Oh, I was worried. What was I doing? It's up here. I don't know if cringe could be comfy. I don't know about that. Oh, uh, let's buy some more. Uh, so, oh yeah. Uh, I the last. I feel sorry for people who watch my vods and things like that because, <laughs> especially last stream, I spent like two hours on the boss, and whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Wait, why did my health bar increase? When did that happen? When did my health bar increase? I trust you saw the it's because I actually haven't been uh, leveling that up. If you can accept my cringe fully, then yes, can be comfy. It sounds like a cult. It sounds like I'm part of a cult. Oh, it even re refreshes. Oh, because of the corrupted hearts. Oh, you learned something new, chat. You learned something new. Have you so so Minerva? <laughs> I was loving blasphemous, but I was also in a inconsistent phase of streaming. So you know how Twitch? Uh, I have Prime, and Twitch allows me to keep my vods for like up to like sixty days. I forgot to export my uh, day one to uh, YouTube and I died inside. So I was like, well, I guess I have to start over. <laughs> so uh, yeah, that's where I am. I, I'm planning to play that because I was really, uh, yeah, it was my first ever playthrough to Minerva. My first, yes, yes. I'm usually decent at having like an internal clock in this brain. It says, oh, by the way, Fox, don't forget to export. I missed it by like a day or two. I missed it by a day or two. I, I died inside. I was like copium to the max. My one of my mods is like, hey man, when are you gonna when are you gonna you know? I was like, I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, population Yes. Yes, population me ouch town. Yes. Yes, I can make it over gaps. You know what? I'll just come back later. I feel like I'm interrupting. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> We're good. We're good. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I can't wait for that air dash. Minerva, you have no clue. I was just... I was, I was, I was chasing around. I felt like I had no hope in finding like the air dash. I was like, how do I, how do I go places, man? I felt like a lost puppy. But now, now I can... I could dash. So eventually I want to go to the green area. Metrovania play. Oh, yeah. Forgot to say uh, I thoroughly appreciate the cat posts on your Instagram. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Did I give a shout out? Who do I need a shout out to? What was I doing? I was doing something, right? I was doing something. I was being productive. Oh, Minerva. I was watching you play another game fairly recently and i was just like one of these days i'm gonna chat in her chat but sometimes i just keep enjoying watching i'm just like yeah we're good like i i'm such a bad lurker and like even in channels i mod in i still lurk so like occasionally like if people people don't know i stream like there's people i've talked to for like two to three years and they're like, oh, yeah, it's nice chatting with you and stuff like that. I was like, yeah, man, it's great. It's great hanging out on your stream and stuff like that. And then eventually I raid them. They're like, wait, you stream? I was like, yeah. How long have you been streaming for? I was like, well, coming on, technically my first stream was six years ago. So I guess we, if, unless we want to go from affiliate day, then five years. And then they're like, I hate you. And I'm like, oh, I'm so sorry. I totally get that. Yeah, I sometimes I just get... I get immersed into the lurk. I get so immersed. That's why people are like, why, why didn't you say hi? I was like, what do you mean? You're, you're in the zone. I don't want to interrupt your zone. I don't want to interrupt what you got cooking up over there. I like seeing you in your natural environment. It's so satisfying. Oh, that's so satisfying, too. Just, like, one-tapping these guys. Okay, dude, you just tackled me. 
But Minerva, oh, what type of games do you like to play? I know that's probably like a loaded question, but I promise, I promise there's a reason I'm asking it. I won't be able to answer why I'm asking it, but there's a reason I'm asking it. Oh yeah, I'm just curious. There we go. Yeah, there we go. I'm curious. That's yeah. There we go. Hey, you want to? Yeah, come over here. Come over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is good. Now, let's see if we can get access to this area. Why are you concerned? Why are you suspicious, man? You gonna call the FBI on me? All right, make this jump. You can make this. Yes. Oh, it feels so good. Oh. This is no place for a child. Where are your parents? I do not think I have any. However, RPGs, souls like platformer, Metrovanius. I wasn't at one time. Did you already do your first playthrough of Baldur's Gate 3 by any chance? Always get curious. I know of a place where you'll be safe. Head to the manor. I'm most grateful to you, sir. You're gonna not you're not gonna escort her? Dude, you know how long it took for me to find Air Dash and you're gonna ask her to just find her way back to the manor? You're so cool, Eric. You're so cool, bro. Well, I gotta get my souls back. <laughs> Had to go get my souls back, I guess. Eric was tired of my freaking fox. God. See? Imagine. It looks awesome. I installed it. You installed it and haven't opened the game yet. It just seems like such an undertaking right now. So have you have you played Divinity? I know you just asked me if I played it. I haven't played Baldur's Gate before. I just get curious. What's the um, what is the the excitement, the buzz that follows? Oh, dude, it's only sixteen hundred. And you can also play Baldur's Gate on co-op, I believe. Not that I, uh, I'm an expert or anything. Oh, let's try going over here. Let's see what's over here. Can you, uh, can you get up there? Do I need a double jump? Yeah, I guess there's some form of a double jump. Or maybe there's like something stupid. There's a ladder here. You like D&D &D and the romance? Oh yeah, I can imagine. You, yeah, yeah. It's the, I, I, so like me and Witty, we were at Vegas and we went to a, a Boba and like a couple other people, of course, too. And like I, we went to this uh, one Boba place that specialized in video games. Like while you're waiting for your drink, they had like... Uh, dedicated areas where it had a switch and you could play smash bros or uh, mario kart and things like that so i started talking to my server and things like that i was asking her i was like oh yeah we're coming from twitchcon and stuff like that um have you heard of dark souls that guy over there k witty he's a big deal he's the ambassador and things like that and she's like wait really she and he just she looked in the direction it's like oh wow and then um, I proceeded to ask her what game she plays and stuff like that. And she said, oh, I play Baldur's Gate. I was like, oh, you play Baldur's Gate. Is it because of the romancing? And then she like stopped and like looked at me and then looked around 
like their like the camera of the the store was on her or something like that. She's like, I can't answer that here. And I was just like, understandable. That's okay. Expose. Oh, there is a double jump, and it's BA. Okay, cool. Expose. Yeah, I I have a a knack from <laughs> putting people on the spot with uh, awkward questions on occasion. So. If you ever uh, see me in the public eye, it's okay. I understand if you avoid me. I understand completely. You're like, oh my gosh, it's that guy who asked me a thousand questions before I can answer the first question. And then it, it gets a little awkward then. It gets a little awkward. Okay, so we can't go there. But I think we could go there. Oh man, it's so nice to have a dash. Oh, it's so nice. I have so much health now. I probably could survive a hit or two from the dragon. I wonder if I should fight the dragon. <gasps> Oh, that's a wall. I got it so excited. I got so excited. Oh my gosh, you almost got one tap, dude. Oh man. They got me good. They got me so good. Man, you play so you play RPGs too. I always get confused what an RPG is because it's like a role playing game. Oh, okay. So does that mean like a game that you play a main character like uh, The Witcher? You're playing a role specifically. Or is it like one that you actually can adjust the stats to? Things like that. Or, like be like Cyberpunk or uh, Dragon Age Inquisition or things like that. So I always get a little confused like what people define as a true RPG because JRPGs you play the role of a specific character a protagonist so to speak has been super diluted okay I would consider as a specific character okay because like for instance like I wouldn't have any issue if somebody were to call like uh, Dark Souls an RPG though because it's not it's not a specific character you're just a random guy who turns into a hollow and proceeds to carry out like you're the protagonist of the game but you're not you're not like uh what is it a Geralt or anything like that like a specific main character so I always get curious like is that fine too I would cause uh, I have the concept of RPG like overall strategy with level up mechanics and turn based combat. That's how you learn it, like Final Fantasy. So, oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Why was I lighting up? Whoa, 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 whoa! Is this good? Is this good? Am I going? Am I Super Saiyan God? Do I hit you? Oh, I was turn I was burning. I was I was getting burnt up. I was getting cooked. Like almost all games now follow a story and have a bit of Yeah, that's why I get like if you have any form of a story in there, then why wouldn't it count as uh what in the Okay. I'm bleeding. Role playing game could apply to so many. Oh, Minerva, you're a fellow bee enjoyer too. I knew you were good peoples. Not that you were, I already knew you were good peoples to begin with. I, I, I'm trying to remember how I was introduced to your stream. There's so many potential possible. 
Because there's times where I, I, I sit through raids and I was like, oh, I'm nervous streaming and things like that. B is awesome. She is. She's absolutely a bundle of joy. Thankfully, I had the pleasure of meeting her fairly recently. And AP. AP, I like, uh, oh my god. I, I, it's funny because it's easy to talk about AP because of his emotes. And then he was talking about his experience at Twitch. <laughs> Just like, hey, I'm more than my owl emotes, guys. But I will always give him credit where credit is due. Because I, I love, I love great emotes. Like, I love my emotes. But, like, other people's emotes, when they're top notch... I can't help but give kudos in that direction too. I'm just like, ah, oh, so good. Oh my gosh, AP emotes are so good. Where, would you, have you been to TwitchCon before Minerva? Or have you been not interested in it at all? Cause I always know a lot of people have their like concerns and stuff like that, crowds. Everybody has that introvert tendencies things like that oh you went two years ago you went two years ago you would go again nice you would go again which one would you more likely go to or what i guess it depends on the location because Vegas was nice, but I always brought this up. And not the the obvious haha uh, on the nose. Like, oh, Twitch bans gambling and they go to Vegas to host it. But I said it from this standpoint. I was like, man, Vegas is a lot of stuff. And it's interesting picking it as a site. Because your, your platform consists of... 90 to 95% introverts and even the extroverts still share like introvert tendencies and stuff like that Vegas almost has a lot almost too much going on for it so it's just interesting that that was the even considered a choice but it was a good time like I, I, I won't complain about it I, I enjoyed it I, I, I enjoy San Diego. I enjoy both of them for different reasons, but it's just like, it's just interesting to think about. I'm burning. I'm cooking. Can I? Yes, you can. All right, we'll find a save point. It would be nice if it was different location. I would say uh, the most painful thing this year for me was doing the double happiness. And I, if I have the opportunity to and I'm able to split more often, because going solo bolo is so expensive. I went to both TwitchCon EU and TwitchCon this year. And I would do it again easily. But holy heck, I can't, I can't do what I did last time where... I was in between jobs because my contract ended at my previous place. And then I proceeded to uh, go to TwitchCon EU. And I started with London and then made my way to Paris. Holy heck. All right, it's not bad. Not bad at all. 8,000. Whew. It is, oh yeah, yeah, we definitely, almost five hours, definitely longer than I. Oh, <laughs> uh, let me give you a proper shout out before we start our raid. Uh, let's see who we, definitely check out Minerva. Do you, do you prefer, are you okay with Vivi? Or are you okay with Minerva? Like, do you have a, per, like, specific, uh, how, how do you go about how do you go about it? 
Thanks. It was nice to chat with you. No preference. All right. You said no preference. All right. Okay. All right. But yeah, it was absolute pleasure for those who are new here. Yeah, more than welcome. Do have a Discord. We, I, I want to start doing movie nights again. So we'll definitely make more of an effort to do that in the future. Um, but I might watch an episode of The Wire tonight before going to sleep. And uh, yeah, hopefully enjoy myself in a productive manner. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, AP is playing League after eight years away. Interesting. When I saw AP, like the initial part of AP drop, I thought it was related to League. Ah, it's cool to see. Hmm. Hmm. I actually haven't rated Cat before. Cat Link, we can show her some love. I had the pleasure of meeting her. Please also call me Nikki. That's my name, and that's oh, okay, okay, all right. You're more than welcome to call me Fox, or anything that comes to mind. More than welcome to. But it's a pleasure to officially meet you, Nikki. All right. And I hope you have a lovely evening. More than welcome. You have a great night. How about that? How about that? Let's see. I hope, oh, I didn't even ask you about your Thanksgiving. That's so rude of me. Thanks for the stream. Thanks for being awesome, Nier. How about that? How about that? Thanks for being absolutely awesome. And no you, no you, man. No you. Ha ha ha. Let's see. Oh yeah, that works better. But yeah, I will catch you all on the flip side. Hope you have a lovely, 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 lovely evening. Or something like that. <laughs>